Hey, it's Jordan, and welcome back to my channel. So I'm just here for a quick writing update. Um, first off, here are my new covers for my books. I love them so much. See, this is the first one, Jasmine Press and the Wicked Sorceress. And it's like she has a tiara in front of her palace with her ma magic, and I just love it so much. But my favorite out of three covers, I'm not going to show you the last cover yet because the book hasn't come out, so, but this is my favorite out of all three of them because it's just so amazing and beautiful. See, she's in two different realms, the magical one and the normal one, because that's kind of what the second book is about. You know, she's from the magical world, but she's in the normal world, and she can't get home, and she's just trapped, you know, and it shows her with her magic, and how, and it's just the color schemes of it, and it's just, it's absolutely breathtaking, and I love it, so shout out to the artist, Caroline Lynn, she, you can find her on Twitter if you want her to do yours, because I highly recommend her, she is amazing and she did an amazing job on all three covers and i can't wait to show you guys the third one once it's published as well and yeah but the point of this video is to tell you a little bit about my writing update um in the third book i uh just yesterday during my writing sprints i did with a couple writing friends um i wrote this i had my characters talking about the Legend of Lilac and Rosemary. If you have not read my books yet, Lilac is the villain, and Rosemary is her sister, who you also find out at some point is Jasmine's ancestor. And so it's about them. And I'm also planning a prequel about the two of them and their brother that you didn't know even existed until this scene, where, where you actually find out they have a brother. And this entire passage, the because I talk about the legend, and um, this is what everyone knows, because there's still some, some things you don't know about what's exactly happened that the legend states until the prequel but this passage just sets the tone and plot for the entire prequel and I'm and I didn't even I've already started the prequel to get it kind of up in the air and ready for once I know this one and I can really work on that one I get it published soon after hopefully and but this passage just ended up tying into what I've already planned for the prequel so perfectly and it sets the entire tone and plot for it and I'm just so excited that it that I could do that and so now when this is published the prequel will be all ready to go and I can publish that soon after and yeah so I'm really happy about that um, but my writing is going good um, I have a lot of time on my hands and I'm gonna really focus on my writing and my YouTube channel so you I'll be doing more uploads and uh, so I'm going to be cracking down on my book. I'm hoping to publish it within a month. And then the prequel, I hope to publish by the end of the year. Um, mm -hmm. So, yeah. Uh, there's one more thing I want to say, and that's uh, someone has been reading my series. Uh, she read the first one, and she's currently reading the second one, and she's anticipating the third one. Um, she's told me how much she's loving my series, how much she loves the characters and the plots, and she told me how talented I was, and it just it all made me really happy. But she said once I publish the third one, and she buys it, if she could send it to me so I can autograph it, that would have mean so much to her. And when when she said this, I'm not I'm not I'm not kidding when I tell you I legit cried. I, I was so happy like. Somebody cares enough to want my autograph, and she's saying how much it would mean to her that she really just wants an autograph, and I'm just so happy, and I got so excited last night, I could not sleep, I was just, I was jumping, and I was fidgeting, and I just could not sit still, because I was just so happy that somebody wanted my autograph. I mean, my first autograph was with my mom, my mom was, when I, I told her, like, immediately, obviously, and uh, she said that, you know, an autograph from your mom is one thing, but an autograph from a random person is another, and I'm, I'm just I'm so happy that somebody wants my autograph. But I just want to share that with everyone. And I, yeah, so if you not have not checked out my books yet, please do so. Um, they're fantasy. Uh, there's, like, strong friendships, because I believe in that. Um, that, uh, like, I, I just feel like books 
focus more on like couples than friendships. And don't get me wrong, I like a good, good couple. I have a few of them in my books, but strong friendships between characters is just everything to me and I feel like we don't get into that enough. So there's definitely strong friendships. There's an enemies to lovers at one point and um there's different realms obviously especially in the second book. And yeah. So if you like those things please check out my books. They're available on Amazon. You can look them up by their title names. This one is Jasmine Prez and the Wicked Sorceress. This one is Jasmine Prez and another realm. And then third one is going to be called Jasmine Press and the Enchantress and the prequel I'm still working on the name I have a couple ideas haven't uh, decided on which one yet but I still have time obviously and then um uh but you can also look them up by writing my name uh, in Amazon which is Johara Harper two R's because a lot of people only say one R but yeah so Definitely check out my book if you are interested in those things, and I hope you enjoy them. And so please like and subscribe and comment um, your writing pro pro progress if you are a writer as well. And I'll talk to you guys later.